Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we are bringing you a clean with me. We have family coming in from out of state for Thanksgiving, so we are getting our house in order. We normally never have anything in this corner of our house. We just had it set up to do our try not to laugh challenge. We are trying to figure out a good placement for a good backdrop. And this is what we used that day. For our fireplace, we use Method Wood Cleaner. I really like it doesn't have a scent and that's one thing that I like about it. So a little background on our furniture. This was my mom's um, chair from the nursing home. She passed away this year and so I kept it and I just haven't found a cover that fits it well. So I just put a sheet over it and then my couch is actually my great grandma's and it's like a classic sofa and I like the way it is. I just don't like the way it looks because it's covered in floral and it's just not the theme of our house. And so we have these covers we put on two of our couches and they do not stay very well. I got them at Walmart and they were like $75. So if anybody knows where I can get a better cover, please leave a comment below. After our kids aren't so little, we'll probably be buying new furniture. We have old furniture in our basement as well. It's just a smarter way to keep our furniture from getting messed up if we had new furniture is just to use older furniture to save us money. Give them a satisfaction they couldn't get any other way. Since all my kids are older, they do tend to help when it comes to cleaning the house. And so this is actually what we would normally be doing. I'm not the only one that cleans the house. I don't think it's fair because I do not make this disastrous of a mess on a daily. So I make them help me. And it's also a part of their chores. So it kind of is just a benefit that we record it and they think it's cool that they're on YouTube. So it kind of just helps. We also just moved into our house a couple months ago, so we're still not done decorating or unpacking for that matter since my husband is gone half the time every month. I just had a baby and I haven't been able to unpack a whole lot of stuff, just been super busy and when I was pregnant I couldn't lift a lot of things. So we're just trying to get into a rhythm and trying to decorate and see what we want and where placement is that we like. So hopefully soon we can show videos of our basement after we decorate it a little bit better. But this is the top part of our house.
This is a small entryway between two of my daughter's rooms and they seem to always put stuff in this area. I do not know why. I need to put like a basket or something there to catch all their stuff, but I haven't figured out exactly what I want to go there. I'm sure you moms out there can relate that kids do not keep their stuff in their room. It seems like the kitchen is the center of attention when it comes to toys and homeschool stuff in my house. Our eight-year-old unloads the dishwasher and our six-year-old um, loads it because she cannot reach to put the dishes up and she has broke too many dishes so I have decided to let her load the dishwasher and let my eight-year-old put everything away. Give them a satisfaction they couldn't get any other way. It normally takes my six-year-old about 20 to 30 minutes to load the dishwasher because she's just naturally distracted all the time or she just tries to not do it correctly. But today when we had the camera on her, she really enjoyed it and actually got it done pretty quickly. I'm using Methods Wild flour I believe it's called for the countertops and I'm using the method dish cleaner for my sink and you can get those products in a link below.
You can also check out my YouTube channel for a Grove unboxing to see what I get normally and what I get during the holiday time. The spray I use for my countertops is the Method Wildflower. It is an antibacterial spray and I like it because it's an antibacterial spray. With having little kids, I just find it as a bonus. And so I tend to use this one um, the most and you let it sit for 10 minutes and it works as an antibacterial. If you don't let it sit, it doesn't work that way. I'm in love with that lamp. My oldest daughter got me that for my birthday this year and I'm just trying to find the right placement for it and I still haven't found exactly where I want to keep it. The picture frame and the game off to the side of the wall, I'm actually going to be doing something with that. Since we have family coming down, I'm going to do some decor on my wall with the frame. And the game we're leaving out because the kids are just going to keep bringing it up and down the steps and I don't want my walls to get banged up so I'm just leaving it there for now. Thanks for stopping by and checking this video out guys. We really hope that it motivated you to clean your house and maybe inspired you to get your house ready for Thanksgiving and we just thank you so much we appreciate you guys stopping by subscribing liking commenting and sharing we really appreciate that many blessings to all of you guys Can you guys take that table down?